got this from Artec, the k &N induction kit, so I'm just going to change it uh, from the standard one and just go through it. First, um, take this off and then the kit's going to be mounted uh, using the bolt. Uh, and take this off. Uh, now that the hose is off, uh, I just need to, there's two mountings in here, so just, the air box will just come out and also a mount in here, the intake for the air comes through. And focus. This bolt, I can't actually get this off the mount. I can't pull this off the mat, so I'll have to undo uh, this here. Hmm. Right, I've got the bolt out, so it should just come off. There's two hands per I've got the intake pipe out. So I two clips on that side and the other side. And just brought it up from the top. Now I just need to get the air box out to put the other filter in. Now there's just two mounts and the air box should just come out and then there was two mounts there. But I didn't realise one underneath, so I had to pop it up first. Then just got these out now, so you need to take this out and then get ready to put the new one in. Before I put the new uh, filter in, I just put uh, the cold air feed. So I need to cable tie this uh, to the side and put it underneath where the filter's going to go. So and at the bottom of the car. Where it comes out, but I need to point it forward so when I'm driving, cold air can go in and it feeds up to the filter. So instead of getting hot air around the engine, it can get cold air through this hose. So I'm just going to do that now. In the kit, you get um, there's a mount I need to make that holds the filter in position. So I'm just going to make the mount see where about the filter will sit and then I can angle that uh, and tie it in place so I'm just going to make the mount for this uh, for the, just take this bolt out it's so the 18 size uh, so I'm just going to take it out now I made up the bracket that sits on here so I'm just going to take the bolt out now and then put the bracket on just finished it. Um, I don't know how much I recorded because it's getting well, got quite dark. So I've fixed that in position now. Um, it took me a while to actually get the filter on the old hose because it's quite a tight fit to get in. I don't want to split the old hose, but eventually got it in. Uh, but that cable tied. Uh, need to adjust it a bit so it's more underneath the filter. The bottom one, uh, that's done up. In the future, it might. Some people online have taken out the front fog, put the hose going to the fog. So, might do that in the future. But everything's set up, so I'm just gonna start and make sure everything's okay.